Welcome to Oak Basket TV channel. So back to us here. Hello, everybody. Hmm. Hey, England. Ah, United Kingdom people, how are you people? How is everything? Ah, yeah, really. We, we, we saw, um, what's her name? Let me just, before we go to that, our Camilla case. Ah, who she called Pufuni? Not you people here. Side chick. Kwenu. Side chickens. Hey. hey. Side chick. Pending the time that you marry is not a bad thing. I'm not saying that go and date married men. No. You understand? I didn't say that. You people, you, you know, as I'm talking now, some of you that hate me, you magnify what I say by changing the narrative. Hmm? The ones that we are against on this platform is those of you that go and be destroying people's home and killing people. Of blessed memory, Princess Diana. Etiwa Loga. The senior Saichiki, while I am a bloggy Camilla and Biba, what if she queen? When you uh, uh, they now help you people, they say it's console queen anyway. They said that uh, pa -pa Papa kindly advertised before the first case. Okay, they said I should advertise. Okay, this one that I'm wearing is not a uh, part of it. What do you mean? She's not your queen, Bao. Please don't say that one. No. Please just say it inside your house and go. Just call you my boy. You know, they matter. Man. All those ones don't matter. Her husband was not referred to as king. How come Camilla is being crowned? The oh, <laughs> let me explain to you. And <clears throat> anyway, let me, let me show you people your poster. Not you, uh, you people understand what I mean. Inside chicken, inside chicken, my boy. So, what side chicks, there is always hope. They did this cup for you people. See, they did this cup. For you people. Hmm. Camilla. Bayeje. Hmm. Prince. Although some people will come now. You won't talk about the man. What did the woman do to you? She be to you. So. So. Now. There's a. Poster that came out. And the poster reads. Two adulterers. I will go back to what I want to talk about, but let me just give you introduction then. I will go to what and I will come back. Two adulterers. Think about it. If they put this in in question and answer and they say, write minimum 2,000 words from it. 2,000. That is critically analyze it. Well, lie. You first of all choose the word. What is the meaning of an adulterer? Okay. That's where you first of all look at. They said two adulterers who divorced their spouses and God. You first of all look at the meaning of adulterer. Is it true that Camilla and Daddy Wa Charlie are they adulterers? Are they Rigbo? If you look at it very well, yes. Yes, again. Yes, yes, yes. Washing, cutting, open, adultery. They are big time adulterers. Yes. And they didn't now stop there. You will now define adultery. After defining what adultery means, then you will furthermore say, who divorced their spouses? It's true. One was married to our oh, oh blessed memory princess. Let's post here. We shall come back to it. I'm our father. What is happening to Judy? Kino de Judy. Eh? 
Who leave you here today? Who leave you here tomorrow? What is it again that Judy has done? That she's, I saw her here, I saw her there, I saw her there. Hey, she's still writing and updating. Hey, hey, what did Judy do again? Let's go there. Hmm. Hey. Oh, Judy. Jesus, na my papa, Mary, na my mama, Holy Ghost, na my darling, why I know. Why I know, go make it younger. Why I know, go make it younger. Jesus, na my papa. Mary na my mama, Holy Ghost na my darling, why I know, why I know who is always by my side, a wonderful God. I have a very big God, he is always by my side, he's a wonderful God, he's always by my side, I have a very big God. Who is always by my side, a wonderful God by my side, by my side. We now, we now, we now, we now, Jesus, you don't we know. I say you go win forever. We know, we know, oh my God, who is always by my own in my life, oh I say, you don't we know, oh, you go win forever, winner, are you a winner, or I am a winner, hello Jesus, Hmm. Are you a winner? I am a winner. And the, oh, are you a winner? I am a winner. And the Lord, are you a winner? Are you a winner? I don't know about you, but I am a winner. In the Lord Jesus, I am a winner. In the Lord Jesus, I am a winner. In the Lord Jesus. Hmm. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Father, I worship your name. Hmm. I'll continue to praise and exalt your holy hmm. name because you are so wonderful to me. On in my life. Uh, I really don't know where to start from. I I don't know where to start from. God loves me so much. I know it might sound strange to a lot of people, but God loves me so much. I, I don't know if he loves anybody as much as he loves me. To my love, come. He loves me so much. You will not understand. Hmm. They said it's who that wears the shoes know exactly where he pinches. Also, some more mama. It's only me that knows. Just me. But God loves me so much. He has continued to fight. He has been... He has been... He has been also, uh, I really don't know where to start from. I'm a special child. I am so special. From the time I was born, mm. from my childhood, my youth, mm. till I gave birth to all my kids, even till this last baby. Oh God, I have experience. I've experienced, I've experienced a lot of things in this life. I actually started experiencing it from a very tender age. But you know, one thing is consistent in my life. And that thing is God's love. Hmm. 
he has loved me all the way. Even when it seems like, even when it seems like I won't make it, even when it seems like the trouble around me will swallow me whole, somehow I pull through. Somehow I, 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 I will still be at the top. I don't know how that happens. I'm a special child. I am so special. Hmm. But I don't have to know because God works in mysterious ways. He has truly, truly shown me that I'm his number one. Hmm. If, 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 if I want to talk about what I've been through hmm. in my very tender life, very small, like I, I, all the time, if I really want to talk about my blessings, I don't think we're going to go today. God has truly been awesome in my life. Hmm. Anybody around me will tell you. Every prayer point that I've ever written down, God has answered every single one of them. Hmm. Every single one of them. And you know what? He can do it for you. He can do it for you. You see, in in, in the it, we have a lot of we have a lot of problem poverty war in the world now. But I don't have to know because God works in mysterious ways. He has things going on. So it tends to make people lose faith in God. Mm. It tends to make people once they dig in here, pray, 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 nothing, they move to the, to the next place. That's not how to worship God. If your faith is not 100% in Him, then you won't experience what I'm experiencing. I am here today because I have 100% faith in God Almighty, in Jesus Christ of Nazareth. He's my one and only. Mm. And the age behind me, you see, I brag with my God. Mm. I brag with Holy Spirit because he has done so much for me. Hmm. He fights my battle as if I'm a princess, like I'm a queen. Like I don't have to ever stretch. Just sit down. Let them come. I'm with you. Things going on. So it tends to make people... Anybody that tries with me, the Holy Spirit scatters them. Hmm. How special can I? Can you get? This is it. This is the height of being special in God's arm. I'm his number one. I am God's number one. God, I thank you. I thank you, Jesus. I thank you, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I thank you, Lord God Almighty, for all you have done for me, for all you've been doing for me, and for all you are yet to do for me. I thank you. God, I thank you. God, I thank you. See, just have 100% faith in God and, and forget the rest. Hmm. Have one hundred percent faith in God. No matter what is happening around you, it means nothing. Hmm. They say one with God is with majority. You are you shading anybody? Because people, people, people are you hmm. People, people, they wish you bad. They want you to die. Yeah, yeah. So you don't have to hope. You don't have to try. You don't. Anybody that tries with me, the Holy Spirit scatters them. Okay. How special can I? Can you get? This is it. This is the height of being special. Okay, so God loves me so much. I am a winner, says you, Edo, uh, Judy. You, Edo, she says as she worship God in new video. According to Judy, she has a very big God that is always on her side. She mentioned that God has been fighting all her battles. She says she can make younger because Jesus is her father. Mary is her mother and Holy Spirit is her party. Holy Ghost is her party. She also said, stated that God loves her so much and makes her a winner. Her husband, Yul Edoshe, shared the video on his Facebook page. The video comes weeks after Yul and May lost their first son, Kambili Chuku. Let me just read a few comments. So because she had sex with a married man, God will automatically turn his eyes away from her. Yes, she committed a sin. So somebody is saying, uh, um, okay, there's no need to mention the name, but some, a, a commenter said, yes, she committed a sin, but please let people worship in peace. There is no greater sin. I understand when there's no greater sin. 
I understand when people condemn her action because she was very wrong for putting Asunda in May's marriage. But please, this is a lady talking about the goodness of God in her life. Let her worship her God. What if she has asked for forgiveness and now happy? Now, what for people? For what people, most of us are here sinning by judging her now. I'm on the Lord's side. Biko, uh, have you, uh, uh, let me just mention this person. Avila Divas, no comment anymore at this point. Okay, you know her. I, she's, she's, she's somebody I like so much anyway. Okay, then somebody else says, we sincerely apologize to the general public for this act of nuisance. This woman, this one is this woman is one of our psychiatric patients who escaped last night. We urge the public to go about their normal businesses as efforts are in place to put her captured soon. Thanks for understanding. Another person says, so she did, she did make up, then came to break silence. Happy silence break, you know. Then somebody else says, they are, they have started mocking Queen May because she lost her son in the process. Now, let's pause there. There's nothing bad about you serving God or you, Judy, um, singing praises to God. Of course, <laughs> of course, of course, in, uh, in the comfort of her home, she's obviously doing that. In the church or anywhere, she's ob obviously doing that. But while singing that song, mind you, there was an update that took place um, that you, when you came out to talk after a few days, you know, regarding, his, that was last week or so, or last, um, yeah, over a week now, that he came out to talk about Kambili, Kam, Kambili let me say Chuku, please, Kambili. <laughs> when he came to say how he left home that day, not knowing that he was, you know, you know, he did an update. He's, he broke his silence and said some things on his platform and people were lamb blasting him. People were insulting him like, no, sorry. Some people were trying to address that, oh, he is the cause of it if he did not marry me, you know, and people came there to also took side with him saying people should stop, give this man a break. You understand? Just leave him. I, it was more people on his side on that post. So Judy took up on her platform, which is her Instagram, and she went ahead to share this, you know, sadness with you. And he met, she mentioned you. She she and she also made mention of can believe she could be in her son. You understand? She 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 talked on it, and pa, people took it from there, and they blasted her like will you get off the whole sh matter this thing she should not do by she should not talk she should just go you know it's just online in law so that we're fighting this matter on instagram oh. they were angry and bloggers took judy and yuli uh say yuli it means today judy and judy's update a use update they took it and meshed it together they put it on their platform and people were they just even ignored you they were abusing her abusing her what's the, what is with this judy rest eh you know they were speaking Igbo. many Igbos. you could tell that many of the comments were Igbo. Uh -uh. you know they were really giving it to her and everything now the thing i want you people to notice is this after this incident had gone on that she came out and she displayed some kind of, you know, empathy, tears and everything, nobody cared. Nobody cared about how she felt. Nobody was interested in her crying. In fact, they felt she was shedding crocodile tears. In fact, they were abusing her with her tears. Like, you are the cause of what happened. Do you understand? Nobody wanted to even feel the that they said she fainted. She, some were even... God forbid, you know, some were even wishing what had happened to me would have been to God forbid, you know. They were trying to wish it to the let me not say how, you know, you don't understand what I mean. But that is for her to know that the world is not smiling, as in the people they are not smiling at her. And these are the people that are your fans, these are the people that are your followers, your husband's follower, May's follower. These are the people. Do you understand? They are not happy. 
they are especially be due to the complicity of the matter okay so i expected that if she had common sense you know this is our brain look at it very well it's an app you understand obviously before even you did that update she had started doing her advert back you know her endorsement i think she has she, she advertises for people and stuff like that if you go on facebook you see her page functioning her instagram functioning may from that day till date i am yet to see her update in fact she's not yet out she's still i bet still dealing with the matter god help her god heal her it's not going to be easy but god be with her yeah so now with all that you are seeing that the public is not ready to have you in this matter you just feel rest you just go away from judy use matter now having to see this update you know you can tell she's shading maybe people some people someone it is obvious because she says god is fighting a battle ah what she has seen what is happening to her definitely use case is among the thing oh that a god has scattered the people that have done something to her mind you the insensitivity of the matter is may just lost a child and you everybody is apportioning blames which is normal even though i will not lie i believe if god doesn't allow something to happen or permit it to happen it can never happen and why do i say so the story of job makes me to know that there's no leaf that drops from any tree especially in the area of life and death that god is not aware of reason why he permits it is just what i as a being i cannot sell you people i don't know but i heard in the bible i read it there where is where it was written that the devil's ghost was going to and for it goes to and fro on this earth searching womb to devour it's in the bible and that's why they say to us that since without pray without season, you never know. The, the canopy many of us have over our head that we believe we run into to shield us, to, to help us, is God. And other people don't have that. Some people believe in uh deities and many other things but for those of you that have the same belief like me you know it's god so but even at that we can say that may is not prayerful i don't know about her christian life but i want to believe she must know god and when god allows anything to happen only him can tell us why he allowed it now if it is judy that allowed that killed the child now then i know say god will be the one to fetch her deal with her it may not even be her it may be her general sorry i'm not i'm not saying judy did it too i need to be very sincere i'm only saying but that god allowed it life and death is in the hand of god I don't know if I'm self-explanatory. I've explained myself, my, you know. So that's why I'm not able to say it is Judy that did it. Because if God allowed it, why did God allow it? That is to say, the matter is between God, Judy, me, you, and if it's another person that did it, and those people that did it, let them not die again. Let them stay on this earth. And live forever more. Ah, ah. God says I'm a God of vengeance. Leave it to me. As much as I am a double-breasted God that loves my children, I provide for them. I'm also a consuming fire. <laughs> I don't 
I have no question. It remains unquestionable. So back to the matter. You coming out today now, Judy, when they have said, go and rest. Go and rest in here. The fact that, yeah, you've continued your business. And I don't think anyone should raise any bro if she continues her business. After all, it's not her child that. Abby, uh -huh. you may not even know if it's her own girl. She may still continue her business like that. Maybe she doesn't have any way she's going to eat. Thanks for watching and thanks for your time. See you next time. Bye.